Hi, how you doing? Uh, you're watching Andy WTH. I'm Andy. Uh, anyways, this is the Big Brother edition again. Uh, we're going to give you an update on the whole week today. Uh, I've already gave you some update uh, on the last video, but that's all right. We'll just uh, kind of go over again. All right. All right. Uh, this is where we're at. Okay. As of uh, yesterday, uh, last night, we watched the episode and Maddie was uh, evicted. No surprise. But let's before that before we get to that point, uh, let's just talk about the whole week. All right, as we all know, uh, Ramsey uh, was self evicted earlier in the week. Uh, he won veto, then he self evicted himself out of the house because of uh, family uh, medical emergency. Uh, apparently, his dad had uh, six bypass uh, done this week. But I guess he's on the meds. He's in recovery. Uh, that's good. Good to hear, Ramsey. I'm glad to hear it. And anyway, so Ramsey's out, and of course they have to have a replacement nominee. You know, okay, listen, I've said it before, and I'll say it again. When the HOH is going around looking for somebody to nominate, okay, rule number one, never, ever, ever say, you know what, I'll go up as a pawn. Don't volunteer to go up. It's absolutely the stupidest game move in Big Brother, period. So, of course, okay, so, so we got that part. So, guess who, of course, decide it's going to be, see, this is how it got there before I, I get to that. Tim wanted to put up Jared. He wanted to get the brothers to do that, right? So, he went and talked to the brothers and, uh, you know, and it wasn't, they weren't really uh, biting on that, eh? So he figured, oh my God, I got to do something to really stir up the house and whatever. Okay, what does he do? He figured, oh, I got a good idea. I'm going to go up to them and say, hey, put me up. And you know, in the meantime, the buzz were talking. And they were saying, geez, you know, Tim is, you know, he's trying to control the game, trying to be like the puppet master if he did. They kind of noticed that, okay? So they thought, okay. Let's have him as our main target. All right. So they were planning to put him up anyways, no matter what. But it just, he came in after and said, hey, uh, put me up. And it's like, oh, okay. And they're like, oh, good. So they put him up. And they said, now, they wanted to get him out now. But is it going to work their way or not? I don't know at that point, right? So anyway, so Maddie... Decide. All right, we're gonna have a big area meeting or a big house meeting, I should say. And they brought everybody downstairs in the living room. Of course, Tim was there, and he was actually quite impressed with her meeting. She basically took Tim and threw him right under the bus, right there. You know, she was saying how he won and all this stuff, and you know that she's a lone wolf, a free agent, if you want, so on and so forth. And she, she was telling him how he had this person, that person, and so on and so forth, right? That's going to look after him, which she was absolutely right. And I thought, ooh, this is not going to be good for Tim. But anyways, so we went through the whole damn thing. And, of course, the the uh, the night of the, the vote last night, and then Maddie got voted out 5-0, uh, which is her fault. Anyways, because just remember, uh, was it last week? Or, not, or the week before, I guess. Uh, she was HOH, okay? She wanted to make everybody walk on eggshells instead of building bridges. Instead of building bridges, she built a bridge of eggshells, basically. And, of course, eggshell breaks. And she paid for it with her attitude the week before because uh, let's put the reality where it is, okay? Jarrett was not going to vote for her. Kelsey was not going to vote for her. There's two right there, and of course, the England girl, Nikki, was not having nothing to do with it. So, there's three votes right there, out the door. So, and of course, uh, Tim's uh, co-game uh, player in the game, the cast, she was going to keep Tim in there, obviously, because it's better for her game. So, and Joel, while well, Joel's going to vote for ma with the majority anyways... So that's where it's at. Now, so just do your, and Tim, though, was very, very lucky they didn't get voted out. 
he calculated it right, but generally speaking, it doesn't go that way. So do yourself a favor, Tim. Don't ever do that again if you want to win. All right. Now, let's get right down to the HOH, the rumor mill. Uh, this, is, this is how the HOH was played out this week. All the loved ones that are remaining in the house, uh, they were playing for them to be in HOH, to win HOH. So each of them had a family member. And what it was, they were sitting up on a platform, basically. It looked kind of nice, you know, like a big pit and everything. And they had to count those. They were dropping boulders down in the bottom of the pit. So they had to count whoever's got closest to a thousand, either before or after, closest to it, they win the, the HOH for their uh, loved ones in the house. So, and plus, I think they get to, we'll, we'll see that on uh, Sunday. Uh, basically, they get to see their loved ones as well. I don't know how they're going to do that, but in the house. Now, and I think there's also, a, there's always a twist, obviously. They have to pick two others or three or two other people or something like that to go with them, so on and so forth. So, so you can probably see like two or three loved ones in the house as well, or they would interact somehow. So that's how it's going to be. Now, who won the HOH? Well, casted. Uh, she won it. She's the new HOH. And now, up to now, she was saying, I'm the mastermind. I'm the puppet master. Well, we're going to see how good she really is. Who is she going to put up? Who would you put up if you were her? On who I put up and not put up. Right off the bat, my three main targets, if I was her, because just remember, she's working with Tim, and Nikki is really not dangerous. Uh, so, right off the bat, the three people that I would put up automatically would, or, well, the two people, then a third nominee as if they win the veto, it would be Jarrett, Kelsey, Hands down would be the first two up, no matter what. We're going to see, because right now all she has to uh, select from is uh, Jarrett, Kelsey, Joel, the brothers, which is one, uh, Nikki, which would be a waste of time to, to, uh, to nominate her because she's absolutely useless in the game at this point, and Tim. So, and there's what, uh, two, four, six, seven. So, there's seven people left. And basically, after this week of veto, everybody plays veto from here on in. So it's like, okay. So anyway, that's what I put up. And who's going to go home? I, If I was the house, the one I would vote out, if she was still on the block, would be Kelsey. Because if you notice, too, all the women are going out. Oh, well. So that's what I'm saying. I think it's going to be a guy that's going to win it, I think. But anyways, so that's what voted out. Definitely Kelsey, hands down, of the two, because she is the brain. She's, I mean, Jared is just the bronze, and be quite honest, he's not that good in competition. Now, next week, of course, is double eviction. So that is going to stir up the, her the, the hornet's nest, as they say. So that's going to be quick. So basically, by the end of next week, we're at seven now. So we're going to go from seven to five. Like that. So that means there's still, there's going to be about three more weeks of Big Brother left. So we're almost to the end. So I right now, I believe Nikki will be the final two no matter what. And with her right now, the top two contenders that I have to say that's going to be in, in, with her is going to be Tim and his uh, girlfriend, uh, Cass. She'll be. Those are the two I think will make it to the end. The brothers could go home next week too, depending on what happened. Jared could go home, and Kelsey. Those are the. Those are the three people I think is going to go by the end of the week. They'll be out of the house. Anyways, that's my assessment for this week, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed my video. Um, you know that's great. So if you like what you see, just um, subscribe below. You're watching uh, Andy WTH. So we'll uh, talk to you guys there. If you have any comments as well, just put it on the bottom. I enjoyed those. So uh, we'll uh, just remember, watch Big Brother Sunday. See ya. Bye.